Hey guys, it's Jessica with Lake Charles Toyota Technology Department, and I am in a 2020 XLE Highlander, and I wanted to show you guys this cool feature that comes with our Toyota Safety Sense 2.0, and it is called Road Sign Assist. Now what Road Sign Assist does is as you pass signs on the side of the road, it's actually going to put them up on your MID up in the corner for you so that you can see what signs you just passed, especially if for some reason you maybe miss a speed limit sign or something like that. Um, now, what we're going to do in order to make sure that it's turned on first is we're going to use our four arrows on the left side of the steering wheel and we're going to click all the way down to the little settings cogwheel here. Now we have all of our safety features listed. We're going to head over to what looks like a little car looking at a sign. Now it is turned on, but what I want to show you is that you can actually hold down and adjust the notification method. Now there's a couple of different ways that Road Sign Assist can let you know that you have um, gone above a certain speed limit. What it'll do is it will either outline the speed limit in orange, which is the only visual notification, or it will do a visual notification and it will also beep to let you know that you've passed up that speed and that you're now speeding. So if we go ahead and click this, we're going to take this out on the road and what I'm going to do is show you how it notifies you with a um, audio and a visual and then I'll actually turn the audio off and show you just a visual. Um, but besides that, we're going to hit the road and see if we can find some street signs. All right, guys, so we are on the road, and here is our street sign. We are going to pass up a 35 mile per hour street sign. So we're going to pass it up, and in just a second, you'll see it projected in the top right corner. There it is. That's a little hard to see with my phone. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to get up to 35, and then we're going to go one mile per hour over just so that y'all can hear the notification and see how it outlines itself so 33 there we go so now you see your speed limit sign is illuminated in orange you got your little ding letting you know that you're speeding and that you need to slow down now we're passing up a 45 mile per hour sign you're gonna see it's gonna change to 45 we're gonna get up to 45 and if we go past 45, we're gonna get that ding and that orange. I mean, slow down, you're speeding. All right, guys. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go into our settings here. We're gonna change, oops. We're gonna change our notification method to visual only. So I can show you guys what it does when we speed on visual only. So we have our speed limit sign there at the top right. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna get going. Now we are gonna pass a speed limit sign for 50, so we should get a change in the speed limit sign there in the top. Drop my phone up, make sure you guys can see. There we go, so we should get our 50. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go right above 50 and you're gonna see it, it wraps itself in orange. There's no ding, because you turned the um, audio notification off. So all you have is that visual notification, but you still have your speed limit sign up there letting you know that what speed you should be going. Now, the Road Sign Assist picks up four different types of signs. It picks up speed limit, stop, yields, and do not enters. So it's not going to pick up everything on the road, you can't read street signs with it, nothing like that. But at least whenever you're driving down the road, just in case you miss maybe a speed limit sign, you know exactly how fast you should be going. If you guys have any other questions or need us to answer anything for you, let us know. Besides that, you guys have a great week. Bye!